Hell yes. Um, good morning, Nikki. It's uh, April 6th, 2013. It's a Saturday. This has been a weird week for me. This was my first week on full time, like not being a contractor anymore. First time I've been gainfully employed in like six months that wasn't like a scary, shaky thing in as much as this industry ever has any sort of stability. Uh, but it's been really, really nice. I've, uh, I've actually reached a point where I feel sort of comfortable. Um, I'm not as terrified of the weight of the possible future uh, like I used to be, which is nice. Yesterday, uh, this Friday, uh, I did a thing where uh, I hung out with people after work and went drinking. And, you know, that's not exceptional. I've done that once before. But staying over at a friend's house, it's kind of cool. Like, I got to see sort of parts of Cambridge I'd never seen before and uh, got to hang out and really connect. And uh, just people are damned fascinating. To just sit and hang out and shoot the shit and learn about people. And we were discussing loving love and the notion of passion and how, how you can really, like, I'm just interested in people that really feel the shit out of something. That they, they really believe in something or they're, they're really interested in something. Uh, passion's cool. What you're passionate about is sort of less relevant. Gearheads, doctors, you know, physics nerds, whatever. It's... It's cool. It was really, really cool. And she's, she's an interesting kid. Lots of passion. She was telling me that she uh, fell in love with this dude that she met at GDC and that he's just amazing sounding and so, so perfectly connected to her and, and, and relevatory that, like, she was a little uncomfortable about it. And, like, well, that's a little too perfect and it's weird, but it's this whirlwind storybook, like, don't question it live it kind of thing um it's it's really really cool watching uh her be as excited as she is about him and sort of feeding off that energy uh, so i got up this morning uh got up at like five in the morning and uh walked back to the to the metro and it was super duper wild like the idea of just going into another state just for the hell of it coming back you know, rolling up on my, my sweetie pie, like, before she's even awake, and I've already been across the state. Like, not that big of a deal in New England, when the state you're crossing is the smallest state in America, but it's still weird. It's weird to get up and walk through as Cambridge is waking up, and it's the earliest of mornings, and it's silent except for a little squirrel barking, and, uh, you know, then just catch the train, roll on in. It was cool. It was, it was good to do. I don't know if I want to do it too much, though, because, like, I feel bad for, for leaving Kelly home alone on a Friday night. But uh, it's it was a good experience. I uh, Novelty amps me up, and uh, new experiences when I'm controlling them is uh, it's a really good thing. It's good. I like it. There's a queer game jam thing going on at the MIT uh, Game Lab today. Um, if I hadn't spent the night hanging out in Boston last night, I'd have gone to it today. You know, weekends are precious when you rock 12-hour days, so I wanted to make sure that I spent as much time with my sweetie pie as possible. But it looks so cool. It's just sitting around and talking about what kind of games you want to make and having the sort of queer focus to it and meeting queer game industry kids would be a really cool thing, so... I'm hoping that the next time something like that comes around, I'll, I'll check it out. I started, you know, keeping up with the women in gaming on, on Twitter and whatnots and, uh, you know, trying to be uh, trying to be sort of part of the, the whole Boston area queer game dev scene. Like, it's, uh, it's, it's exciting. Cross-stitch. Good idea. Totally need to, to do that and remember to do that because it's a craft. While on the subject of cool things I need to remind myself to do, trying to get a beta for uh, Fulbright's Gone Home, the beta for that's coming out, and uh, I have been really, really bad about playing my friends' games, and that's shitty. Um, it's I the I love these people, and I it's important to be into, you know what what your people are into, and like it's important 
to be into like when you love people to be into what they're into right like it's it means a lot to sort of give a little extra to pay attention to what your friends are creating and what your friends passions are and it's it's only been amazing to sort of encourage and provoke that so like i need to play my friends games uh and and get into those betas and give them crits and like you know that's how you can be a good friend to people so need to remind myself to do that hold me to it among the things i need to do that's that's important the gone home beta tower of guns these should be done they're good that's about all i've got for this week um Oh yeah, I've started doing a vlogging thing, so that's kind of interesting this week. Um, I have no idea if I'll continue it. I don't know what more it'll be, but uh, it's uh, it's your turn now. Take care and have yourself an awesome week, and I'll see you next week. So, so I got up this morning. Uh, got up at like five in the morning, and uh, walked back to the to the metro, and it was super duper wild. Like. The idea of just going into another state just for the hell of it, coming back, you know, rolling up on my, my sweetie pie, like, before she's even awake, and I've already been across the state. Like, not that big of a deal in New England when the state you're crossing is the smallest state in America, but it's still weird. It's weird to get up and walk through as Cambridge is waking up and it's the earliest of mornings and it's silent except for a little squirrel barking and uh, you know then just catch the train roll on in it was cool it was, it was good to do I don't know if I want to do it too much though because like I feel bad for for leaving Kelly home alone on a Friday night but uh it's it was a good experience I uh novelty amps me up and uh, new experiences when I'm controlling them is uh, it's a really good thing. It's good. I like it. There's a queer game jam thing going on at the MIT uh, game lab today. Um, if I hadn't spent the night hanging out in Boston last night, I'd have gone to it today. You know, weekends are precious when you rock 12-hour days, so I wanted to make sure that I spent as much time with my sweetie pie as possible. But it looks so cool. It's just sitting around and talking about what kind of games you want to make and having the sort of queer focus to it and meeting queer game industry kids would be a really cool thing. So I'm hoping that the next time something like that comes around, I'll, I'll check it out. I started, you know, keeping up with the women in gaming on, on Twitter and whatnots and, uh, you know, trying to be uh, trying to be sort of part of the, the whole boston area queer game dev scene like it's uh it's it's exciting cross stitch good idea totally need to to do that and remember to do that because to craft while on the subject of cool things i need to remind myself to do trying to get a beta for uh fulbright's gone home the beta for that's coming out and uh I have been really, really bad about playing my friends' games, and that's shitty. Um, it's I the I love these people, and I it's it's important to be into like when you love people to be into what they're into, right? Like it's it means a lot to sort of give a little extra to pay attention to what your friends are creating and what your friends' passions are, and it's it's only been amazing to sort of encourage and provoke that. So like. I need to play my friends games uh, and and get into those betas and give them crits and like you know that's how you can be a good friend to people so need to remind myself to do that hold me to it among the things I need to do that's that's important the gone home beta tower of guns these should be done they're good that's about all I've got for this week um oh yeah I've started doing a vlogging thing so that's kind of interesting this week. Um, I have no idea if I'll continue it. I don't know what more it'll be, but uh, it's uh, it's your turn now. Take care and have yourself an awesome week, and I'll see you next week. I feed off energy a lot. Probably a succubus. <laughs>